Hey, what's going on guys? This is Malcolm, you're on Malcolm Talks, what's up? Right now I wanna share with you something that I found online, it's called App Sheet. Now basically what you're looking at is my face, first of all, but you're also looking at my cell phone. And in this cell phone I have what's called a, well, just a simple to-do list, but it's a to-do list that I created based off of a Google spreadsheet that I was able to create um, took me about a day to do it so it's not as easy as they make it seem but it's pretty simple so basically what I can do is click on this button here and open up my to-do list now the first thing I'm gonna set is the priority you know how important is whatever it is I'm about to put in here because that's one thing that a lot of these to-do list or apps are missing they allow you to put what you have to do for the day, but they don't let you choose the priority, like what's most important. You know, Google Keep. I'm sure you guys have heard of Google Keep before. A very popular um, app that will allow you to put different things, you know, to-do list on there, but it doesn't have a, a feature to let you put the the most important things at the top you have to manually move everything around yourself and I don't like that so I created this app so let's just say that I'm gonna do something and this is gonna be high the priority is high so what's the task well let me see I don't know the task um, let's just say it is to go to the store to get milk okay I'm just making up an, an example next is status what's the status of this it has not started yet as you can see I have not started in progress and complete what category is this work home business or personal for some reason home is coming up a second but I wanted business to come up a second anyway I have to fix that later so that would be personal start date is a uh, defaulting to today the due date you have to put that in when do I want to have this done by well I want to do this by Saturday set that what are the notes let's say I want to put a note I can also use the microphone or I should be able to let's see pick up organic milk okay it's not picking that up because I'm recording on the screen so let's just put a little note here to pick up the organic milk not the regular whole milk okay so this is just an example and then I click save now what happened just now is that since I put the priority as high I had a default to um, there's gonna be a star next to it as you can see right here I'm gonna open this record back up again you see but if I switch this to urgent and click save, now it actually jumps up the list for me, right? So when I'm planning out my day or, or, or whatever it is I need to do, I don't have to think anymore. All I do is just do it at the top of the list. Because see, so oftentimes we waste time on doing things that aren't really that important. We could be using that time towards doing things that are actually important. So when I make my to-do list, now I can actually sit there and determine how important is this. Let me just be real with myself. I might not feel like doing it. I might not want to do a particular task. But if I know that it's urgent or if I know it's important, then I need to mark it as such so it goes up to the top of the list. And so I just start at the top. Every day, I just start at the top of my list. So I got a lot of things on here for work. Um, you know, I got a schedule of physical. That's important. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I got to get a lot of stuff done. I got to redo my vision board. I got to get chairs and tables for my son's birthday party coming up. I want to get a professional detailing for my car. See, I put that down here as low. That's not, you know, getting my car professionally detailed is not... Um, something that has to happen right away I can wait for that I need a new cell phone case 
you know, the one I have, I mean, it still works. It's got a crack in it, but at some point I'll get it done. It's not something that I should be focusing on right now. Make sense? Well, hopefully you guys learned something from this. Um, let's see. Once again, the name of the app. Let me get you that real quick because I forgot. Um, what's the name of the app? App Sheet. The name of the app is called App Sheet. Okay. And I love it. I really like it. I've been using it the last couple weeks and it's been working for me. So guys, go ahead and comment, subscribe to my channel. This is Malcolm Talks. I certainly appreciate you visiting the channel. And I'm going to see you guys next time, all right? Peace.